Just download Telugu Stop Android app in Play Store or iOS app in App Store and stay tuned to latest news as it happens. Tehran, July 24th, Iran and Qatar have vowed to strengthen cooperation in all areas, particularly in trade and the joint construction of infrastructure projects, media reported. During a meeting held in the Iranian capital Tehran on Sunday, Secretary of Iran's Supreme National Security Council, SNSC, Ali Akbar Emadan, and Qatar's Assistant Foreign Minister for Regional Affairs, Mohammed bin Abdulaziz bin Salah al Khulafi, highlighted the necessity of expanding bilateral cooperation in those areas in accordance with specific plans and schedules and removing the obstacles to such cooperation, the report said. Later on Sunday, the Qatari diplomat met Iranian Deputy Foreign Minister for Political Affairs, Ali Bagheri Kani, and discussed bilateral relations as well as regional and international issues of common interest. According to Iran's official news agency ANA, Khulafi pointed to the growing relations between Doha and Tehran, saying his country is willing to improve economic ties with Iran, Shinwa News Agency reported. The two diplomats called for a collective action by Islamic countries, especially through the organization of Islamic cooperation, against the desecration of Quran in Sweden and Denmark. The Iranian deputy minister said the burning of Quran is tantamount to trampling the basic and inalienable rights of two billion Muslims, adding such acts in Europe are flagrant violations of human rights. He added that Denmark and Sweden are responsible for putting an end to such cultural brutalities in their countries. On Friday, the far right Danish group of Danske Patriota burned a copy of the Quran and trampled an Iraqi flag in front of the Iraqi embassy in the Danish capital of Copenhagen, according to Danish media reports. The move was meant to protest against the Iraqis' attack on the Swedish embassy in Baghdad on Thursday, according to the group. Hundreds of angry protesters stormed the Swedish embassy in Baghdad on Thursday. They set fire to the building in protest against the desecration of the Quran and the Iraqi flag in the Swedish capital of Stockholm. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to channel and click on bell for more daily videos.